What's up guys and welcome back to the Station Bakery. In today's video, I'm going to walk you through how to create these easy cake jars, but stick around to the end because I also have an extra surprise for you. For this tutorial, I will be using some leftover cake tops that I had from a cake that I had just made. You can also use whole cakes or cupcakes. These jars really can be filled with whatever you like. The jars that I'm using are 8 ounce jars and they are plastic. I used glass jars back during the holiday season and I wasn't the biggest fan of them but these jars I absolutely love. If you're interested in them, you know where to find them in the description below. Here you just want to break up your cupcakes, your cake tops, whatever you're using, place it in the bottom of your jar and press down firmly. I always like to start my jars off with cake but you can mix it up and do it however you like. Once we have our first layer of cake, I then go in with the buttercream and give us a nice swirl. I like to have a two to one ratio to buttercream. I mean, just pretty much, I like to have more cake than buttercream, um, but if you're a buttercream lover, you can put more buttercream or whatever filling you're using. I press down my cake in here just so I can get as much as I can. Typically, I can fit about two to two and a half cupcakes in this eight ounce jar. To complete your cake jar, you want to just repeat that step, making those layers all over again. Now, when you get to the top, I prefer to put more cake at the top just so the buttercream does not stick to the top of the jar. But that's just my preference. And here we have it, our cute, simple, delicious cake jars. These jars are awesome quality and you can jazz them up any way. Put your sticker, put your label, your logo, whatever you like on these jars and they are good to go. Now, here's a secret tip if you don't want to invest in the jars. Use plastic cups. Here I just have a regular nine ounce solo plastic punch cup. I'll be using cupcakes in this demonstration just to show you how much you can fit within these cups. We are going to start off with the same process of starting off with a layer of cake. I will split the cupcake in half and just press it into the bottom of the cup. Once I have my cake layers in, I just go over it with a layer of buttercream, just like I did with the jars, and then I repeat this process one more time to top it off. You can easily find these cups at any grocery store, any retail store. Um, they don't have to be this particular type. You know, you can use any plastic cup, but I am going to show you why I chose this specific cup. So stay tuned. You guys, how cute are these cups? Just look at all those beautiful, delicious layers. Now, here's the trick. This coffee cup lid. Guys, this is a game changer. When doing cake cups, you always run into the issue of how do I cover these for the customer to receive them? Well, this is how. Can you believe it? The part of the cup that you would normally drink out of is the perfect size to slide a fork through. Secretly, I think that this was their intention when they made these in the first place. <laughs> but guys, look at how cute, how simple these cake cups and cake jars are. I hope this video has given you great inspiration on what you can do with your cake cups and cake jars. If it has, go ahead, give me a big thumbs up Hit the subscribe button and turn on that notification bell so you know when I post another video.
All right, guys, until next time, peace.